Okay folks, welcome back to Northwest Bushcraft. As promised is a review of this Czech Army bedroll. Uh, it's a, a great piece of kit. I slept in it last night for the first time. I really wanted to kind of give it a go before I started you know, kind of reviewing it. There's no point in not using it and trying to do a review. It just wouldn't be honest. So um, the price of this is $9.99. Uh, I won't say where I got it from. I don't want to be accused of advertising. Uh, so it was $9.99 for it. Um, a couple of quid postage. It wasn't much really. Um, from what I found out last night, it's actually a really, really good piece of kit. So I had it in my hammock last night and I had my sleeping bag inside it and I was roasting. I mean, it's not a cold night at all. It's, you know, end of July. It wasn't cold, but by no means was I cold last night. I was absolutely roasting. So, superb piece of gear. Now, the thing itself, it, it, it all rolls up and I'll, I'll show you how it, how it all rolls up in a second. But you've got a zip on the side goes all the way down and right around the foot so the whole thing will open up like, like a butterfly, the whole thing opens up. Now it essentially comes in three parts. You've got the outer, which is waterproof fully. You've got a hood section here that everything kind of rolls up into. You've got on the inside, you've got this wall blanket here. Now the wall blanket is detachable. It actually buttons in. There's, there's several buttons that go right around the outside of it. So it's wall blanket, to, buttons in here. And then inside that, you've also got this thing inside. I think that they refer to this as what I think it's called the hygiene layer, I think they call it. And essentially, it's like a, another sort of like mummified part inside. So you would crawl into this. That obviously protects the wall against your sweat and any, any smells or anything. This can do up around you. And then you zip this back up over. Zip it up. And there you go, you're inside. Completely encased in wool. The wall goes right underneath it, all the way over the top, so sort of thermally, it's absolutely uh, superb. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try this in a couple of diff different configurations to show you. I'm going to put it in inside my hammock, and I'm going to uh, a bit of an idea for outside. I'm going to put it together, see if it works. Uh, hope you enjoy it. So thanks very much indeed. What I'll do now is I'll, I'll fold it all up so you can see how it all goes together. Um, is it Weight-wise, it's a bit cumbersome. Uh, it's sort of two kilos just over, something like that. But as you'll see in a minute, I think that it is a good trade-off. You've got it's quite a bulky, a little bit heavy, not really designed for long-distance journeys. But if you're having a short trip into the woods, I think this is ideal. So I'll put it all together now, and you can, you can see how, how small it all goes. Okay, see you in a minute. Right, so let's just put the whole thing away now and, and see how it goes. So simply just start at the end, roll up. Good section, pull that around, give that a zip. That's it. Just turns in on itself. There's two buttons at the top end. things in and then it's got two of these sort of rings here strap goes round pulls in through both of them pull it round and then go back in between the two there we go done Okay, so here's a, another potential use for this Czech Army bedroll. What I've done here is, as you saw before, you know, the buttons that are inside, all I needed to do was undo one button that holds the inner wool layer on the proof water layer, tuck it underneath, pull it back over, do the button back up again, and you've got an under hammock quill. So if you want to get into it, all you need to do, slide it down, get into your hammock. When you're laid inside, reach your arm out, grab it on, pull it up, and there you go. You've got completely encased in wool, 
Wool, as we all know, is fantastic for heat preservation. Wool, even when it's damp, wool retains 80% of its thermal efficiency. So, yeah, superb piece of gear. Alternatively, obviously, you can put it inside your hammock, keep you nice and warm. I did that last night, and I had the, the check on your bedroll and the sleeping bag last night. I was absolutely roasted, and I woke up with sweats in the middle of the night. You really don't need both of them. So, in, in summertime, great on its own. So, in wintertime, if you really want to go for it, sleeping bag inside the hammock, this on the outside, covers the whole body, works really well. Okay folks, well I hope you enjoyed that. As I said, this is a, it's a bit of a, an, an all-in-one package really, it's really clever stuff. So I said you can use it on the ground, inside your hammock, it's waterproof, use it as a, an under hammock quilt, a, a, an under quilt if you like, and all in, 9.99, 10 or something like that, you can't go wrong. Okay, well thanks a lot, we'll see you again soon, bye bye.